In this video, I'm going to be introducing coordinates, so from the bare bone basics. So we're going to start off by understanding where coordinates are and what they mean. So coordinates are written like this. So they have uh, they are written in brackets with a comma between them, and you will be given an x coordinate and a y coordinate. And all of these coordinates that we have relate to a point on the xy grid. Okay? So this is what we call the x-axis, the horizontal axis, and the y-axis, the vertical axis. And they relate to the x and the y that we have as in our coordinates. So these represent numbers. So for example, I might have a coordinate that is written 2, 1. And what that means is that I'm going 2 along the x-axis, so to the value of 2, and then to the value of 1 on the y-axis. So it's where those points meet are the coordinates 2, 1. So some people like to refer to this as uh, two along the corridor and one up the stairs. Two along the corridor and one up the stairs. Okay, so you're always going horizontal direction first, then vertical with your coordinates. So if I had another coordinate, something like um, three minus four, then I would be going three along and then four down. One, two, three, four. You could also see that as being 3 on the x-axis, minus 4 on the y-axis, and where they intersect, that is the coordinate 3 minus 4. So 3 along and 4 down. So if I then uh, chose a point, so let's say there, then this coordinate has minus 4 as its x-coordinate and minus 2 as its y-coordinate. So minus 4, minus 2. This point okay, will be well, well, minus 1 on the x-axis and 4 on the y-axis. So minus 1, 4. So a point there, for example, well, that's at 0 on the x-axis and minus 2 on the y-axis. So that's 0 minus 2. So this point way in the middle must be 0, 0. Sometimes referred to as the origin. Okay. So let's do one more. Let's say uh, this point. Well, that's at 3 on the x-axis but 0 on the y-axis. So that's 3, 0. Okay, so you need to be able to plot points given the coordinate, and you need to be able to read off the coordinates given the point. So you make sure you identify that it's the horizontal axis first, and then the vertical axis. So the x, then the y. Okay, so in most cases, the um, the coordinates, uh, the axes will be labelled. Sorry, with the x and the y as they are here. And just remember that when you're actually writing the coordinates in, they need to be alphabetical. X, then Y. 